Good afternoon, this is Frank Biggs with B Young RV in Milwaukee, Oregon, the greater metro Portland area. And today I'm gonna to show you a brand new floor plan from Primetime RV. This is a LaCrosse Luxury Light. Uh, it is a uh, multi-purpose uh, floor plan, it's a 329. And some of the unique things about the new LaCrosse product lines are they're building travel trailers with fifth wheel floor plans. So again, this is a special purpose uh, coach and you'll get to see it inside. And uh, let me come on over there and I'll show you what it looks like. You'll notice the nice, beautiful one piece cap up here, uh, designed so it won't flex. And the diamond plate comes up high because you got the big metal flashing here. So this is well protected up in here. You got the slam lock door locks, magnetic. It makes it real easy. Uh, the new, uh, the champagne color, uh, this happens to be a uh, Lumalux 4000, which is a high-grade fiberglass, gel-coated siding, uh, the primetime product line, uh, they use the best. Oh, look at that, you can see me in it. Oh, air's good. Of course, we have the electric awning, uh, Dometic. Uh, you can set it, if it's raining, it, you know, make the arm set it at length so it uh, dumps the rain all the time. TV bracket, one of the first companies to do it, and it's steel. Uh, the walls on these are about two and a quarter inches thick and they use a two inch aluminum uh, framing in here. This is a bonded wall system. This trailer on all these sides is all bonded. It's a, a big deal. Nice big 30 inch door. Low enough step to get up. Again, bonded walls, even these side walls are bonded. Not many companies do that. This is an interbond system on this. This is bonded aluminum structure in this. Um, we do have three slides. This is a kitchen slide over on this side. Nice big double vent here to make sure it circulates well in there. Furnace, hot water heater. We do have uh, an outside kitchen here. Look how thick that door is it goes up. You can stand underneath if it's raining. You got a little stove top that comes out here of course. Sink. Refrigerator, drawer. Uh, we also come with a barbecue. The brackets back here. I don't like. We don't put them out on the trailer out here. But this thing will. You got the barbecue out here, and you're frying up the nice juicy, uh, you know, 20% fat hamburgers. It really works well. And it is double bib down here. The LP uh, units. We have two of them here in case you want to put in an auxiliary. Of course, you got a ladder going up here. Nice and solid. Again bonded wall system. That window doesn't hold this together. This is built more like a motor home. Spare tire. Uh, we do have electric leveling jacks underneath here. You can see them. The LaCrosse comes with those. Also a power front jack. And you'll notice that this is a trusted roof. It is a walk-on roof. That's why the ladder's here. But if you bring it to be Young RV once a year at your convenience, we'll check your roof sealants for you for free. Nobody else does that. Okay, this is another slide out here. We'll have two slides on this side. This is an extra room slide here. You move along, your power connection is going to be in here. That's the only thing that's on the side of the trailer. We come over to this area here. Your low point drains are all down in here. Uh, this is a fully enclosed underbelly. Uh, you can use this trailer for extended stay. We have a lot of people that uh, now with these new floor plans are uh, kind of living in them. Now, uh, as far as I know, Primetime is the only company on their travel trailers that have a central bay. Your black flush is in here, your water hookup, water fill, shower, I mean the beautiful hose that reaches 25 feet almost, and there's a light in there. And what's also new with this company, we have a battery disconnect in here. I love it. Let's go inside and check this baby out. All right my special purpose lacrosse you know my feelings on the lacrosse made by primetime rv it is the finest trailer on the op on the market that's my personal opinion but it's also the finest trailer we have just the way it's constructed the attitude of the company uh, you know we've had the privilege of knowing the president of this company and the past vice president and those guys have been leaders in the industry and uh, Everybody wants this product line. But anyway, let's talk about this. Uh, we'll, we'll go up here into the bathroom area first and then I'll work around. Um, double access in here from the bedroom. 
or from the here, and then we got access into the bedroom. We have this beautiful shower in here. Beautiful sliding doors. I mean, this is the first one we've seen in the lacrosse. Nice radius cut uh, shower instead of a, uh, a square cut. We got a nice uh, sink area in here. Your hot water heater and your, your control panel. See your fluid levels are in here. And a china bowl toilet. Again, like I say, we have a pocket door here. Um, you got ample shelving back in here. Uh, closet on this side, closet on that side. Nice overhead cabinets. Uh, the electrical plug inside there, uh, in case you had to put a machine or something up in there, but that's new, that cover in there. You'll notice this height in the bedroom. This is now 84 inches. It's brand new, midstream, 2014. Uh, another thing that Primetime does, at least on the lacrosse and where it's applicable, they put a bracket for the TV up here, all right? Nobody else does that. And it's been like that ever since they started business. And you got LED lights up here in the ceiling. That's one of the upgrades on this particular unit. Again, I got a nice pocket door to shut off the bedroom from your company. Move along over here. We got, of course, the Jensen radio here, CD player, uh, Bluetooth, uh, TV with a bracket to be able to swing it and look from above. Nice cabinets down underneath, cabinets up above. You'll really like this closet here. Put the coats in here. Your controls are in here for the slide outs and the awning and a couple of light switches. Out of the way. Doesn't look like a travel trailer in here. Uh, of course, this is an island here. Uh, this is fixed in place. Again, this is a triple slide trailer. Nice deep sinks. Nice tall faucets so you can get pots and pans underneath it. We got cabinets everywhere. Drawers with roller bearing guides. And they're five-sided drawers. People say five-sided drawers. Yes, see this backer here to hold on the facial plate. Lots of drawers. Got a place for a garbage can underneath here. Then we move over onto this side over here. More cabinets. A solid surface countertop. Of course, microwave. We have lots of storage. Big drawer underneath here for pots and pans. And what you're really going to love is this 12 cubic foot refrigerator, Dometic. Look at the size of that baby. Huh. And even got upgraded so you can lock stuff in so it doesn't spill out. Again, look at that pantry. Oh my gosh. There's a garbage can. They gave you a garbage can. Huh. We'll have to stick that underneath the sink. Wow. Love it. And we'll move over to uh, this side over here. You'll notice uh, more space. This is also new. Nice cabinet doors underneath here. You could take like a, a flat Rubbermaid or something and slide it in there put the canned goods underneath that. The nice big U-shape uh, lounge system here. Check out this woodwork here. Instead of having the big balances coming down here when you're sitting up against leaning, we don't have that. So this is a new concept from uh, Primetime to do it this way. And then we move over. You'll notice we have lane furniture in here. Residential furniture and a travel trailer. How about that? This is a foam mattress, hide a bed. And of course, we got a light overhead. Got lots of light. Look at the windows in here. The 329 is actually called a bunkhouse, but you could use this for anything. The doghouse, when you get in trouble. As we move in here, uh, this is another bed system if you have company. All right. Just lift this up, give it a little extra sleeping. So you could put two adults here if you have company or a big family. How about that, huh? Easy to put away. All right. There's another bunk up here that comes down with a mattress. We move down here, check this out. Storage area, you saw that was real plywood there. And then we have the bunk up here with the ladder. Well, I hope you enjoyed looking at the LaCrosse, the new 329 floor plan. Uh, here at B Young RV, as we say, I'm chopping a day and you'll be camping tomorrow. But I welcome you to look at the full line of Primetime uh, RV product lines. This is the LaCrosse. We have the Crusader fifth wheel. We have the Tracer pull behind trailer. 
a little lighter than this. And we have the new Tracer Airs, the Sanibel residential fifth wheels. But I welcome you to come here anytime. We're open seven days a week, except during holidays, and see what we have here at B Young RV. Again, this is Frank at B Young RV. Thank you.